What's up everybody? So, the other day, uh, after my videos, Benny over at Tenacious Toys decided, apparently really, really high, that it'd be a great idea to send me some blind vinyls, collectibles, toys, sculptures, whatever, you know, to give my personal touch to, to review. So that's what we're going to be doing here. Um, yeah. So I hope you guys, you know, can take. I'm not going to be biased. I, I like Benny. I'm not. I'm not biased to to anybody, any artist. Um, if you want a good review, it's going to cost you. Uh, basically, the the price for a good review is talent, skill, and attention to detail. If you don't have those things, then clearly I'm not going to give you a good review. Um, I know you're probably also thinking, who the fuck is this guy to give anybody a review? Well. I'm the asshole that he contacted to give the review. Simple as that. That that there's nothing more to this. I'm nobody. I, I, if you don't like my review, give your own review. So yeah. So anyway, here we go. So far, this is like the most perfect box. I think he literally drove from uh, New York and put this shit on my porch because the postal service doesn't do such great jobs like this. So let's uh, go ahead and crack this bad boy open. My a little special. I know you guys like your unboxings and you know everything's all sweet and perfect and yeah, I don't, I don't do that shit. I really could care less about any of this shit. So we're gonna get the up. Oh, my bad. Got the box. All right. First thing is, I hate all that shit. What? I mean, the fuck is this? Easter? Is there gonna be? Am I getting Easter eggs? Is that what this is? Fuck. Fuck this shit. Don't don't put this shit in here. I don't care what it is. All right, sweet ass coupons, coupons, whatever they're called. Don't don't fucking mock me. Ten dollars off. Uh, use ten bucks to get ten dollars off your next order. Fifty dollars or more from Tenacious Toys. So there's another plus. Sweet ass box that I ruined and the coupon. I'll use that. All right. So what we got here. We got a Hikari. Limited edition piece, Japanese vinyl, Masters of the Universe. Apparently, this is a uh, Funko premium quality Skeletor, I guess. Yeah, Skeletor. There you go. Bam. Skeletor. <laughs> Toy. Um, vinyl, collectible. Uh, off the bat, I don't like Funko shit. If you do, that's your preference. It's not mine. Uh, I don't. I don't. I don't want. I don't want this shit. So we're gonna crack this bad boy open again, saving the delicacy of the box. Oh, oh, there we go, there we go. Nice and opened. Sweet ass sweet. There's like a sticker card or something in there. Nobody cares about that shit. So, got the little package here. We're gonna pop it on out. Now that it's out, let's check this bad boy out. It looks as if it has articulated arms, but it's just a ploy. It doesn't... Oh! I take that back. They move. They were just stuck. You see, this is why I don't collect this stuff. So you break those free. It's cool. Head, same. Um, it looks like it's kind of like cracked. Right here, like, let's see if you can see this in the corner. That is not part of the paint job. There's a fucking crack in it. So, uh, I, I don't see how it could have obviously got damaged in shipping. Uh, the box was pristine because Tenacious Toys sent it to me. Uh, so, yeah, that came out of the factory that way. Superb job. Good job, QA guy or girl. The paint is, I mean, it's pretty pretty basic. Like, I guess like my two-year-old could do. It's just like a solid color. I don't even know what the fuck color this is. Don't expect me to tell you what it is. I'm fucking colorblind. So, it has a sweet little elastic tag. There's a plus. Mm, the wash on it 
it's like consistent through here, but then if you look really close to the teeth right there, whoever did it was just like, you know what, fuck this shit, just, just leave it on there. Don't get that shit off. It goes with the authenticity of the piece. But it's not, because it looks like a fucking coffee stain. Uh, which I don't, I don't like that shit. I don't know if you like that shit. I mean, it is what it is, I guess. <clears throat> I don't know how much the piece is. Um, I guess if it was like, you know, a couple bucks, and you were like a huge He-Man fan, I would take my couple bucks and put it towards like more money to buy some kind of He-Man collectible, because I'm, I'm not feeling it. Uh, and that has nothing to do with the Funko brand. I just don't collect their stuff. I, do, I feel like it should be like in like a, a Walmart, which it may be. I don't fucking know. Uh, yeah. That, I, that's what you got. Like, that's it. It's not like you're going to sit there and wait for it to be like, but it's not going to do that shit. It's just like, hey, yeah. I got this, th this Skeletor. Awesome. So yeah, anyway, we'll probably be doing more reviews unless, you know, everybody absolutely hates this review. Uh, and if you do, that's cool too. Um, but yeah, for this week, day, what, I don't even know the frequency right now, but yeah. So as far as the vinyl itself goes, it's kind of cool. I'm not really feeling the overall design of it. His... This, like even the profile view looks weird to me I don't know it's just like super like it could have been more dimension to the face like a little bit it just is like it's just really flat I, it may be supposed to be like that I don't know and I definitely don't like the paint at all like I know what they were trying to go for and I feel like this is a pretty basic paint technique that like they probably teach you in like pre-k Everybody knows how to do, and that's not even right. So, yeah. Again, Q&A, super sweet job. Uh, yeah, so yeah, thanks guys for listening. If you like these types of things, go out and buy it. If you don't like these things, uh, now you know why. Other people don't like them. Again... My my main my main thing is that this thing's like got a little crack right here. Like I can stick my fingernail in that. So yeah, thanks again, guys, for checking it out. Peace.